We asked Jadarani Devi Dasi, one of the artists at ISKCON Press, to tell us about her involvement in the Hare Krishna movement. So I met Srila Prabhupada in um, 1967, and I was up in his apartment, and the first thing that he said to me, because previously I was thinking that I didn't know what I was supposed to do, so he said, uh, when you reach the top, then everything else is included. So that sort of answered all questions. It's like if you have a, a million dollars, then all of your ten dollar problems are solved. So he was implying that when you become Krishna conscious, then all of your other um, desires and aspirations and ambitions, everything is fulfilled just by taking to the process of Krishna consciousness. And then he asked if I could come to his morning classes. And then I started coming. And then when he saw that I had a propensity for painting, so he gave me two businesses. He said, just be attached to Krishna and to painting. So this is Keshava. Keshava is the name of Krishna. And it means one who has fine hair. So God has hair, he has a face, he has a body, he's not impersonal. He's the creator and the maintainer and destroyer of everything. And he's the dear most friend of every living entity. And before you're asking how my consciousness has changed, but just like um, a lily leaf or something like that that's on the water, even though it's on the water, it's not touched by the water. So even though we're in the material world, because we're working for a pure devotee and for Krishna, we're not touched and we feel satisfied. Satisfied to be in association with Krishna's love of speaking. Uh, 